Hi guys, I'm here today asking for help. I cannot for the life of me get into Xenoblade Chronicles 3 and I don't know why, I don't know how, but I want to so bad. Xenoblade Chronicles 3 looks absolutely fantastic. The trailers got me hyped. The announcement had me so excited, uh, but I've tried and I've tried to get into this franchise. I've put in 20 hours to Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I put in plenty of hours to Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition and I feel like I haven't even made a dent. So help me get into Xenoblade Chronicles 3 right now. So as I just said, I have continuously tried to get into this franchise. In late 2017, my friend used to come over every single week and we would set aside time to play Xenoblade Chronicles 2 and he would try to help me get through it. But it never ever happened. We got about 20 hours in, I got tired of the battle system, he got tired of me getting tired of stuff, and so we just kind of moved on from it. And it was honestly so disappointing because it was such a good game, but something about it just did not hook me. I think the problem is that there's just so much to do that I don't know where to start. I just end up getting overwhelmed and frustrated and feeling absolutely defeated even before I start any of these quests. Another thing is, for a lot of this game, from my experience, you had to do a lot of side quests and grind quite a bit to get to a high enough level to even stand a chance for the story beats. And the whole grinding aspects of these types of games really turns me off. I don't know why, but it just frustrates me that I cannot get enough levels to maybe have a more challenging fight, but at least a fair fight. I feel like Pokemon does this really well. I love the Pokemon series, and I don't have to really, really, really grind on Pokemon to be able to defeat the next gym leader, but I have to grind for hours on end in Xenoblade Chronicles 2 to get anywhere, and I just got a little frustrated. Now, I'm gonna say something that kind of contradicts this. My favorite game of all time is Splatoon 2, and I put in over 300 hours. And yeah, that's plenty to beat any of these games, but I think why I made so much progress with it is because it had so many different aspects. You could complete the single player in that game fairly quickly, maybe 10 hours, maybe less. And then the Octo Expansion, it was also paced very well, maybe five hours, maybe a little bit more. And every single thing was paced so great in this game. I felt like I was always learning. I always knew what I needed to do to put myself in a better situation to win the next Turf War or to win Rainmaker. As I was moving up in ranks, I myself was getting a lot better at this game. But I feel like in Xenoblade Chronicles 2, as I was moving up, getting more levels, I wasn't actually learning the combat. I wasn't learning what I really needed to do to make myself successful in this game. And so I just got tired of it and I stopped playing. And that's such a bummer because it is such a great game. It has so much to offer. The story is amazing. The combat, I have heard such great things. I just cannot understand it. I cannot wrap my head around it. And I wish I could. I think my biggest issue is that in video games, I like to feel really productive. I like to feel that every single thing I do is going to pay off and going to have a reason behind it. Even in Breath of the Wild, when I went off track, at least I would find a Korok or other weapons or something of that sort to keep me going, to keep my adventurous spirit alive. But I feel like every time I drifted from the path in Xenoblade, I might find those little orb things, but they don't do a lot. Like you can't really use that stuff outside of it. I also don't really like the menu systems and it just sounds like I'm criticizing it now, which is not what I'm doing. I am asking you guys to help me get into this game because Xenoblade Chronicles 3, to me, looks absolutely amazing. The trailers had me so excited. The announcement got me jumping out of my seat and I want to play this game. It looks so good. The story in all these games is absolutely top notch and Nintendo has such a good team behind this. The world is great, the characters are great, and the story is amazing, but how do I get past the game not initially grabbing me? I don't know. So that's why I'm asking you guys to help me. Let me know your favorite thing about Xenoblade Chronicles down in the comments below so maybe I can read all those and realize how lame I'm being for not getting into this franchise that so many people love. I know it's a great game. I know there's a passionate fan base behind it. And there wouldn't be that passionate fan base if this game was Garbo. So it's obviously not, so I obviously need to play it. But God, that's a lot of time. So tell me what you guys do. Tell me how you guys like to play this game. And thank you so much for watching this video. If you are a fan of Xenoblade Chronicles, this is not me knocking your game at all. It's such a good game. It's honestly me just outing myself about how 
lame I am with this franchise and how much I really want to be a part of it. Anyways guys, if you enjoyed this video, I would super appreciate a like and if you want to see more Switch content every single week, remember to subscribe. I also just started Twitch, it's kind of a banger, I play Splatoon a lot over there. Might play some games like Xenoblade Chronicles 3 if I, if I end up getting it, so. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you all later.